Welcome back to Let's Play Mars Warlogs, Burning Dog fans. We're asking Mary some questions about her path. Her path? Her past. What are you... What is this? I think you were... How did you end up in abundance in that case? I... My master at the time had to go fight, of course. And he wanted to take me with him. The source wanted to refuse, but he had tremendous influence. I found myself on a battlefield, and I was horribly afraid. I think I panicked, and we were separated. Go on, I'm listening. I was so afraid, I fell into a trench. Some men from Abundance came towards me. They were laughing. I... I think they liked the look of me. Oh dear. And then their officer showed up. It was Sean. He seemed really strict. In fact, he was furious with his men. He helped me get up and kept me near him. I know that he had to fight to keep me. That's why he was sent from the front and ended up in Camp 19. Maybe I misjudged the guy. You must have a virtue name. Mary's not your real name, is it? Right. I was called Mercy, but the name no longer means anything to me. Even if Sean used me, he helped me live again. He stopped me from going insane. He's the one who called me Mary. Just like the rags I'm wearing, I want to keep the name. I understand. I'm not going to lecture you about changing your name. Said Roy. How did you end up in abundance in that case? Oops. I... I found my... Go on. I was so f and then I know that... Why not talk to me about it? I was afraid you'd abandon me to the source. Of course, there are good masters there, but there are also... Anyway, I often served them when I was very young. Oh dear. Listen, I'm sorry, Mary. I know some girls are abused, but anyway, it's over now. You're free of them. Let's get back to my other questions. I want to tell you something else. No, let's go. It's nothing. Well, I'm glad she's found uh, some level of happiness. It looks like we can just keep going and work our way around the uh, back. I didn't even realize that was a door. Hello, fuckers! You need to sweep up. Look at all this dirt. Why do I keep fucking doing that? Oh. Alright, my bad. I saw that one coming, it didn't do anything. Ah! I thought I hit B at the right moment there. Let's just kick these guys' ass, shall we? Mary, move! Ow. Well done. trying to decide if Mercy is one of those ironic names. But really, I think, uh... I'm 
haven't seen her in the right circumstances to determine that. Certainly hasn't been shown mercy, that's for sure. Stick hand in turbine. Press A. So the work just stopped like that. A group of terrorists sabotaged the excavation. We hit them hard, but unfortunately it'll take a long time to repair the damage. This guy again. You think I'm going to wait long? You've got everything you wanted. It's time to show results. The incident at the site won't stop us continuing our experiments at the Shadow Line. Things are moving along nicely. I hope so, for your sake. Or believe me, you'll spend the rest of your life in the Source. Seriously, I could do a better job voice acting than that guy. Okay, sorry about that. We should probably get this information back to Marco. I guess it's just gonna stick there forever, isn't it? Great. Ooh, got a bunch of these. <sighs> a local farmer was complaining about a mole infestation in his new crops. I killed them, so now he should be so he now he should be able to get back to work. The villagers were complaining of thefts of their food stocks by the dusts, but what they didn't say was that they didn't feed them and that the dust were starving to death. I decided to help the mutants survive by telling the people of the village a little lie. That should let them hold on for a while. Turns out it was an angry man behind the crop destruction. I made sure he stopped so the farmer can go back to his farming. I joined Marco at the HQ that he set in Green Hope, and he gave me my first mission. I have to get into a work site set up by the Technomancers and sabotage it. It would seem that the place is particularly important to them for some reason that we're unaware of. By destroying it, Marco thinks he'll ruin the plans that they have here. Mary and I are now together. Strange time and place for a bit of tenderness. And yet with everything that we've gone through, and given the fact that we may die in the attack on the Source, I think we needed it. I'd never have expected it to enter my life like this, but I sure don't have any regrets. I sabotaged the work site like Marco wanted. I hope that it'll be enough to disturb the Technomancer's plans for Green Hope. Now I have to join up with other members of the Resistance in the North Agricultural Area to exchange information. There is a traitor among us. Our so-called secret meeting was attacked by Technomancers, and if I hadn't been able to s stop them, there's a good chance that our resistance cell would have been wiped out. To prevent it from happening again, Marco asked me to get into the Technomancers' building to try and find out who's ratting on us. Wisdom is a hero of the war against abundance and is the new dowser for Aurora. He is a former soldier whose strategic skills shone in a number of battles in the previous wars. He is also an excellent speaker who is capable of gaining the support of all of the classes of the guild to win the war. And yet, since the armistice, he has abandoned his unifying approach in favor of an alliance of the Technomancers. This worksite was set up by the Technomancers, although nobody knows why. Access is closely restricted. It seems very unlikely that it is a simple construction site, as announced. This area of Green Hope is where the industry needed to keep the hydroponics site running is located. It is also where the entrances to the site's government buildings are. This building is requisitioned by the Technomancers in Green Hope. Nobody knows what goes on inside, and access is very well guarded. What the... Uh, that's not good. That means there's mans in the area.
or I guess we could escape. They are going to be so pissed. Someone just waltzes into their base and kicks all their asses. You know, I'll say this from Mars Warlogs, I haven't seen a single zombie yet. So, any news? Did you find anything out? Yeah, I got into the Technomancer's offices. According to some documents I found, the family of a certain Constancy is in their hands. They're threatening to torture them and kill him if he doesn't give them information. Jerry, so it's you. How could you do this? You've been with us since the beginning. Duh, we just told you. I trusted you. You heard what Roy said. They've got my family, and they're gonna kill them. I had no choice. There's always a choice. You risked everyone's life. You risked everything we've been fighting for for months. Everything some of us have died for. He put our lives at risk, but killing him won't change anything now. You're wrong, Roy. If we let traitors live, it means we value personal profiteers over the good of the community. Our ideology and the entire resistance will collapse. So long, Jerry. Hmm. The documents I found indicate where his family's being held. They're at a site of a shadow line that's being built. I heard the Dowser talking about it. At least it's the same place. He was talking about experiments the Technomancers are carrying out. You mean they're experimenting on prisoners? Yeah, I think so. Those fucking monsters. This is sick. We gotta put a stop to this. Roy, can you go straight there? Yeah, it's not far. I'll go right away. Later. I don't like that. Doesn't sit well with me at all. Hey! Hey, please! Please, get us out of here. They're doing terrible things. They use us for tests, expose us to the sun. Some of us have even been operated on. If we stay here, we'll die. Or worse. Help us. We haven't done anything to deserve any of this. I was just in the militia. Okay, I demonstrated against the Technomancers, but that's all. Calm down. I'll get you out, all of you, but I can't break the door down. Do you know who has the key? A Technomancer, of course. Their leader here, I think. He's really powerful and heartless. And he can't voice act worth worry. a damn. I didn't think we Technomancers were capable of such senseless atrocity. I don't feel like I have anything in common with them anymore. These people are sick. Their thirst for power has taken a place in their humanity. Do you think I might become as callous as them? 
lose my head? You're a bit odd, sure, but no, you're not like that, Mary. Don't worry about it. How'd you end up here? It was just after the demonstration. I thought things were okay. I didn't have any trouble when the leaders of militia were arrested. Then one morning, source security showed up at my place. They arrested my wife and me and took us here. She died after they did horrible things to her. What'd they do to you, exactly? I was lucky, in a way. They only put me out in the sun a few times so far. I thought I was gonna die, and I'm covered with blisters, but that's nothing compared to what they did to some of the others. They feed us strange things. Disgusting water. Pieces of flesh that looks human. Some people had mutant parts transplanted onto them. Most of those people died. They also made the women get pregnant by mutants. We never saw them again. Please, get us out of this hell. When I find out who's in charge here, he's going to die. Any idea what's making him do this? How could I possibly know what those madmen are thinking? They aren't human anymore. You may have heard something. Nothing. Just the screams of my friends. And that's more than I wanted to hear, believe me. I'll be back as soon as I can. Try not to freak out if I'm covered in blood. Okay. Sup? Hey, that's not good. Would you lock it off? Now then, who's next? Oh yeah. Do like that last one. Huh, look at that. The drill worms are probably tied up. 
Holy shit! Their drilling worm isn't properly tied up, guys. Thing is alive? Of course it's alive. There's always giant fucking worms in desert planets. Oop. Well, it's a good place to call it as any, I suppose. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Mars Warlogs. When Roy continues his war against the Technomancers. Later.